So, uh, hey, uh, hello. I bet you're wondering why I've gathered you all here today. No, you told us already. Yeah, we know. We're, 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 we're aware. Know. We're, no, we've been planning this no, for like a wait, week. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. No, no. No, it's for the... It's for the yeah. Oh, yeah. Alfred, you're doing great. Play along. Okay, everybody play. We're doing the real-time fan dub for Saints Row. Here. Where the we're fuck am today. I, Penny? <laughs> to pull the veil of mystery away from this project, I will now reveal to you. Today, I have prepared something special. Obviously, we are all familiar with the just absolute plethora of fan works in the Sonic the Hedgehog fandom, ranging from fan fiction to fan mm. art, all the way to fan films. What if I took the concept of a Sonic fan film and merged it with the wondrous technology of neural network procedurally <laughs> generated <laughs> AI? Oh, I thought this was gonna be something else. No, I have, I, I have. I thought we were just gonna shake hands oh, for an hour. I have gone to our good friend. I reveal who killed old man Jenkins and how. I don't know, I thought, that's after. Thought, that's after off the record. Oh, okay. Okay, I thought we okay. were, I thought we were recording Shadow Dub. No, that's after, off the record. That's, 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 that's never that's coming bit, out. That's a little bit later. So today yeah, I, I went to our good friend AI Dungeon and oh, uh, I, I, went, I went to him and I said, can you please help me write my first ever spec script? I will be sending this to studios. I have for you a script for a Sonic the Hedgehog fan film called Sonic Destruction. And you, you, my good friends today are going to help me do a table read of this script. I'm very right. excited. There we go. I intro it. 30 pages. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yay. I'm scared. PDF. What does All that right. stand for? Um, Pretty damn funny. <laughs> Ooh, damn. <laughs> I'm going to read off the characters and if you are familiar with who you are playing, uh, I'm going to I'm going to call out like for example stage directions. Robbie, you can introduce <clears throat> yourself with whatever. Uh, so hey, so the following cast will be stage directions. Hi, uh, I'm Stage Directions. First name Stage, last name Directions. <laughs> Don't wear it out. <laughs> Damn right. Um, I will be, of course, playing Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, reprising my dub role. <clears throat> uh, Eggman will be played by... Hi, that's me. I'm Alfred, and I'm going to be playing... Uh, who, who is this? Um, uh, 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 he, he raises Bacon chickens, boy. I think. Uh, uh, I, I get it. I understand. Thank you. <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog will be played by... Hey, it's me, Ryan. <laughs> Reprising his role from the yet-to-be-seen in the future Shadow the Hedgehog fandom. I mean, also we the Sonic, in the future. Also the Sonic 06 out. dub and also I the like other the, dubs like with Shadow in it. But yeah. <laughs> and I'm smiling. <laughs> And I'm having so much fun. Oh my god, my future self is hey, blushing speak, at your compliments. Speaking of, uh, our good friend Tails the Fox will be played by... It's me, Tails, Mar. I'm Mar. <laughs> I'm, I've already gotten so into the character and I want to fly high and reach the heavens. I love you, God. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh god, dude. I love God. Uh, Knuckles is going to be played by... <laughs> Chase, I've always played Knuckles. That's true. It's, yeah, that that's a true, true statement, a yeah. Fact, and it's a true statement. That's I'm glad you're I will be, I will be, Yeah, no, I'm, I'm really excited to be back uh, as uh, Sonic Adventure 2 Knuckles, which is down here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, the we'll father of Eggman. Is, uh, or, yeah. you know, we might learn some contested information regarding oh, that. Uh, oh. Gerald Robotnik is being played by... You can't just say that by me. The <laughs> <can't>. Spoiler! <laughs> that's a, that's an go. interesting Come name. On, I'll pen. cut it out. I'll cut it out. What the okay. fuck do you want from me? <laughs> fine. You want it? Fine. You want me to be boring? Oh, Gerald Robotnik is gonna be playing. Put by. a big bleep over it. Make it real loud. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can make it, a, Robbie, put, can put you send bleep. me? Can you send me the Liars Club censor music so I can use that? <laughs> the almond break. Yeah, I'll send that over. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> put a. Put a. We don't pay for it. You don't. Gerald Robotnik is gonna be played by. <laughs> Me. He's not even here. No, I'm so confused. Am I Alfie's daddy or not? You are, oh you my are god. god. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, Hello, yeah. Put yes, the almond I, break right I, here. I, it's me. I, it's me. Daryl Robotnik. <laughs> the one. Daddy of all. I'm gonna ring. King of the daddies. <laughs> it's me. Yes. <laughs> Clown <laughs> House's daddy okay, has arrived. The real daddy's daddy. <laughs> returning daddy from, returning daddy. from the future, Silver the Hedgehog will be played by... Me. Woohoo! Woo! Woo! A, a, a little chipmunk that made its way into the studio. <laughs> 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 
I'm a fucking goat. For this goat. one, we shrunk we were, right into we, a molecular oh, sorry. size <laughs> for <laughs> better acoustics. <laughs> the smallest goat of all time. Uh, Amy is going to be played by... Hi, me Holly. I don't know a lot about Sonic the Hedgehog, but I know that Amy has a big fucking hammer and can also be invisible sometimes. I You're going to learn but, about Sonic lore today. I'm going to learn <laughs> yeah, so much. This is all actually incredibly know. lore accurate. Mm -hmm. All of this really happened is the fucked up thing. Yeah, yeah. of course. Mm -hmm. Canon. It did. Um, real. Rouge the real. Bat will be played by... Hi, it's me, Joy, also known as DollopDays.com. Uh, here to reprise my role as Rouge that I've always had, always, for all of time. Awful. <laughs> 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 you have dollopdays.com? Do you have awful? to get it's that? True. It's It's the truth. I mean, I mean, technically, technically, technically it wasn't all time. There was a brief moment where I played Hatsune Miku who played Rouge. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true. right. Yeah. That's true. Uh, right. Princess Elise will be played by... Hi, my name's Sophie, and they made me kiss a hedgehog for this part. <laughs> Yay! It was part of yeah, the you ever, you ever thing thought you'd see Princess even, Elise come back, right? <laughs> she doesn't even do that in this script. It's just they had to do that during the uh -huh. yeah. She does you know, it the in audition. the next one. It was part of the yeah. contract. It's part of the ritual. Mm -hmm. It wasn't and that bad. Last but most certainly not least, uh, AI Dungeon's very <laughs> own Sonic the Hedgehog OC Jason King, the mayor of Station Square, will be played by. No, you, this, you spelled my name wrong. It's Jackson. It's not Jason. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, Jason. You wanna, you wanna, you wanna talk to your future in clown house about that? Jason. No, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> Are we ready to go? Does everybody have the script ready? Yes. I was yeah. born yeah. ultimatum. Yeah. Ready. Yeah. Um, yeah. Also, there might be like one or two lines that are unassigned. Uh, Robbie, you just go ahead and take those if you'd like. <laughs> okay, I'll just, I'll just <laughs> figure, figure that out, I guess. I, I, no, I think there's like one. I think there's like one okay. character that's not assigned, but like that's, it, it's like one line. That'll, um, that'll be a surprise for all of us. Then. Yeah, okay. <laughs> well, uh, Jump scare intro extra. introducing uh, the brand new uh, Sonic the Hedgehog uh, serial drama, Sonic Destruction, episode one. Oh, shit. Let's go. Okay, wow. We fade into view, looking at an unsuspecting city. Suddenly, the silence is broken by a piercing laser destroying the center of the city to bits. We hear maniacal laughter coming from off screen, but soon it will be revealed where it is coming from. <laughs> we cut to our antagonist, Eggman, who is reveling in his destructive plans. <laughs> Done it. Nothing can stop my satellites. My new satellite. Soon I'll build the plan. Just you wait, King Shadow. Oh, the camera. Princess Elise. Ah, I must have missed that part of Shadow. You know, I haven't played Shadow the Hedgehog, but like. That's a cut reference. That's from the fucking comics, bro. I probably shouldn't read the note that says turns to camera. Well, <laughs> yeah, no, let's it's that way. We, we don't have <laughs> to read. I mean, I'll, I'll leave it up crazy. to y'all individually if you want to like read the stage directions, but that's that's up to you. Okay. We now see the backup generators kick on. Small but deadly robots begin pouring in out of the sh ooh, pouring out. Jesus, hold on. Small but deadly robots begin pouring out of the ship, ready to lay waste to everything. Oh dear. I'm too late to stop the destruction of the planet. Turns away. Bah, who am I kidding? No one can stop me now. Bah. I didn't know that Eggman works for the fossil fuel industry. The camera slowly zooms in on his face before cutting to black. Why is the Sonic camera zooming in? Sonic <laughs> destruction. <laughs> Why is the camera zooming in? <laughs> Where my feet don't touch the ground. Is a rooster's crow is heard as we open Wait, wait, up. where are we? Robbie, where's the interior? Yeah, you where gotta read the fucking headers. Am I reading in the on, interior man. to the you Sonic's read hotel? The fucking where are headers, we, Sonic? Robbie? How are we going Why? to know where we are? Interior shot, Sonic's hotel, morning. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank a rooster's you. crow is heard as we open up to see the world-famous hedgehog standing in front of a bathroom mirror with toothbrush in hand. He spits out a bit of foam and stares at himself in the mirror. Sonic's mind quickly begins to wander to the past, to a time he would rather forget. To Sonic Vietnam. To Vietnam. <laughs> <laughs> Gunshots, planes, <laughs> sirens. Sonic closes his eyes and shakes his head, trying to forget the painful memories. He opens his eyes once more, staring at his clean teeth. He remembers his promise to Princess Elise and the vow he made with her. He had failed, and the planet was dying as a result. 
Maybe a nice jaw to clear my head will help. Spits that again. He spits out the foam in his mouth <laughs> and tosses the toothbrush in a nearby bin. He steps outside of his bathroom and promptly shuts the door. He walks into the outer room and sees Tails already up and watching TV. The fox is dressed and ready for the day. Tails notices his friend's in melancholy mood, but doesn't say anything about it. Morning, Sonic. You're up early today. Sonic jumps a little at the sound of Tails' voice. I scare uh, you. Well, uh, <laughs> yeah, well, uh, yeah, I mean, I uh, gotta get that morning jog in to clear my head. Nods. Sure thing, Sonic. <laughs> the blue hedgehog quickly opens up the hotel door and dashes out of the room, shutting the door behind him. Tails squints at the door before shaking his head. He grabs the remote and turns the TV off, getting ready to start his day. Pan to a full shot of the hotel. Cut to black. I'm sure that shot, like, really revealed something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sonic's Hotel. Also, very interesting how we're going with a Sonic has depression arc right now. <laughs> <laughs> Sonic. In this Welcome one, to Sonic, Sonic said so Sonic sad. has PTSD arc. Yeah. Yeah, this is this is the Netflix show. This is yeah. this is like the Sonic <laughs> Iron Man Netflix 3. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna cut to exterior, city hilltop, day. A full garbed trio of freedom fighters are looking at a large billboard. The earth has a giant hole in it, with smoke billowing out of it. A caption at the bottom reads, The end of the world? At the bottom of the hole? <laughs> on a <laughs> on a billboard? <laughs> it's not good. What are they trying to sell? The camera something? pans to the right to see Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. Uh you guys hear about this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was all over the newt. <laughs> <laughs> Hey gang, new hole just dropped. It's, it's so wild, you know, it's, it's like the earth turned into a big Krispy Kreme donut. I don't know what happened. Yeah, it was all over the news. Didn't you see it? Shakes head. Nope. All I saw was you in the paper this morning. Sonk <laughs> chuckles. Sonk! 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 <laughs> Me when Sonk does a little chuckle. Oh, oh man, Mr. Dude. Dungeon didn't check the spell check on this one. Huh? Uh, yeah, my face on the front page. They named me the city's greatest hero. Tails looks at him in disbelief. Really? Nah, that was just a headline. They still called me a hero in the article, though. Knuckles rolls his eyes. He stands between the trio and the billboard. What? We're not here to discuss the media's <laughs> praises. We're here to help those people. Tails looks at the billboard once more before turning his attention to Knuckles. What do you need us to do? Cut. <laughs> oh, I, cut. I love the direction cut. you took that delivery, not in like a like a ready to act kind of way. It's yeah, like what, do you want, what do you need us to do? <laughs> like, what do you want us to do about it? How's this my problem? Listen, yeah, just get a fucking shovel, start filling it in. <laughs> not, dude, listen, just get some flex tape for that bad boy. Interior, Eggman's ship. The day. <laughs> we fade in to see a rather large room. The walls are metal, cold to the touch. There are large fans in the corner of the room, working tirelessly to keep the air flowing. Banks of computers are- that's the- that's the, uh, air sound? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Banks of computers are in the middle of the room, LCD screens displaying readouts of systems that are likely very important. In the middle of it- in the middle of it all is a large, robotic suit, standing at attention. A door opens off to the side of the room, and in steps Dr. Eggman. The suit's head turns to look at him, while its arm unfolds and raises a salute. Oh god. <laughs> while its arm unfolds and raises a salute. <laughs> at ease, zero four two. The robot's arms return to its side. We need to pick up the pace. We have three more robots ready to go, and another twelve under construction. This news seems to please the doctor. He smiles wickedly. It seems to please him. <laughs> you don't actually know, but it seems to please him. This is the, like, seems a Seems like he's pleased. We're, we're, just we're just guessing. at this point. <laughs> yeah, I mean, who the fucking know, know, you know? Who fucking knows what this guy wants? <laughs> he's always flip-flopping. He's all over the place. <laughs> I don't God. think even he knows what he wants. What do you want, Eggman? What do you want out want of life? Anymore. He's a wreck right now. <laughs> <laughs> the first one, CO46, is ready to be deployed. I think it's time we see if your training was a success. The gunmetal gray robot nods once more, then turns and walks out the door. Get out. Cut to interior gun hold day. Tells gun hold. <laughs> Me when I hold gun. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yo, oh, welcome to Gun Holt. Gun is Holt. Gun is Holt. <laughs> we see a massive room filled with rows upon rows of robots. Some are bipedal. Some are some are robotic arms with grippers for hands. Some are large and tank-like. Some are spider-like, and some are tiny. They are all inactive, however. <laughs> tiny, tiny, tiny. <laughs> The camera pans to the right to see a robot similar to 042 from the previous scene working on a console nearby. It finishes its work, then walks over to the robot it's working on, pushing a button on the panel. The panel lights up green with an audible click. Click. The robot then begins to power up, its eyes flashing blue. This process continues down the line with each row of robots powering up in sequence. Once the last row has powered up, all 1,008 robots flash blue. Oh, shit. <laughs> 1,008 robots flash blue eyes and turn to look at the camera simultaneously. I got it. What the hell are we fitting all this? I got it. Just the, the, the cutscene from Sonic Free uh, Gravity. Yeah, like Zero that. Gravity. <laughs> yeah. Can I, can I just say, I think it's really ambitious of Eggman to say, all right, the first one, number 46, is finally ready for deployment. And then he made about 960, <laughs> 60, <laughs> like 972 more just for the hell of it. I mean, the fuck else are you gonna do during lockdown? Am literally, I right? Yeah, I <laughs> <laughs> he literally made that just for, so if someone comes in without an air fryer, everyone can look at him like, did you really just come in here? Like <laughs> <laughs> the first one is ready to be deployed. The rest of them are in beta testing. <laughs> They don't have air fryers. <laughs> Eggman posted a picture of 042 and he's like, just a little work in progress. Tell me what you think. <laughs> Might delete later. So, so, so it says, looks gay. Clearly you don't have an air fryer. <laughs> Clearly you don't own an air fryer. How did you know I didn't own an air fryer? <laughs> because you just told me. To <laughs> <Fuck> boy. <laughs> Exterior, hilltop, day. They're still there? Sonic and Tails are staring at the robot horde warily. They turn to look at each other. You think we should run? What else do you do? Tails considers this for a moment, then grabs Sonic by the arm. No, they haven't seen us yet. Nods toward the robots. I've never seen this model before. Sonic looks at him, puzzled. Huh? <laughs> wow, you're so, I'm so good at being puzzled. That's so cool of you. Sonic the Hedgehog being played by Tim Allen. <laughs> we need to check it out. Maybe there's a way to stop them. The two heroes jog over to the robots, a saunterly jog over to the robots, <laughs> who continue to mill about the hilltop. Also, where uh, the fuck did I go? I I, I have been I've been done so far. <laughs> you, know you went two heroes. You went. Hey, Tails you're didn't want to get it done, so you had to go oh, do it yourself. You fell you're in. in. You're in the hole. I fell into, or you're I fell into the hole. Dots. I don't know. Interior, back at gunhole. <laughs> you ready to feel my grip? The camera pans over to a large glass window in the wall, where we see a close-up of a man with a gray military haircut and a clean-shaven face looking out over the room. <laughs> He smiles. Beautiful, isn't it? The camera then pans over to see the man is Dr. Gerald Robotnik. He stands, arms crossed, staring at a row upon row of tubes filled with a clear, viscous liquid. Gross. Inside each one, a particular creation of his swims around. Hi, I'm a creation. <laughs> this creation is a black creature, vaguely humanoid in its shape. It has small legs, two short arms with claw-like fingers, and a, and a long, snake-like neck. A single, large eye sits in the middle of its head. A single, toothy mouth fills its entire underside, with three nostrils by its side. At the base of its throat sits a gem, a blue, translucent gem. These are the specimens of the beast known as the Horde. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Oh Gerald, Gerald looking at his test tube like, yes, my ultimate creation, a fucked up snake that can only live in, in fucking middle <laughs> Work in progress. Indeed they are, Dad. With this. What? <laughs> <laughs> What's that man doing here? His dad. His daddy. His, his, his pops. His papa. Gonna, uh, papa. Everyone shut up. His papa. <laughs> <laughs> I want to let it be known that when we saw this uh, this lineup, Devon immediately went, I'm going to be your dad. 
Oh, I told you to call me daddy when we're at work, son. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. With this, the military will have the last word in any war. The military? <laughs> well, like, you know. Isn't that like... <laughs> yeah, the troops. We see a close-up of a single tube containing a slightly different creature. This one looks very similar to Sonic, but colored black and red. There are a few notable differences, however. Its arms and legs are longer. Its eyes are larger. It has a long, oh. lizard-like tail <laughs> instead of a second hand. <laughs> what? What? Sonic's what? 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 second hand. Hello? Listen, Wait, so Sonic. The tail is coming from the top? <laughs> Listen, <laughs> Sonic. I have found new power in becoming a scaly. In addition, this beast has a gem located in its stomach rather than its throat. What? This is my crystal <laughs> gem <laughs> cosplay. To its awesome. I eat it. It's my gem soda! <laughs> no, 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 no. How is the ultimate life form faring? The camera pans up to Dr. Eggman's face. It seems to be developing well. Its strength, speed, and resilience are far beyond that of any creature. The camera pans back over to the tube. If it continues developing at this rate, it should be able to survive outside the tank for three more months. I have an important commission for you. The camera switches to an outside view Wait. of the entire room. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Why? The camera switches to an outside view of the entire room, where we see that it seems to be located at the bottom of a large underground complex. Large metal hallways twist. They love large. Large metal hallways <laughs> large. twist and wind their way several hundred yards in any direction. Whichever way you want. Military <laughs> soldiers stand ready at <laughs> various so intervals. Various all, <laughs> all equipped with the latest weapons and armor. Large, heavily armored <laughs> large, machines huge. are parked in the center of the halls. Large metal <laughs> elevators connect the floors above and below this one, where more soldiers prepare for battle. Battle? The camera slowly zooms in on a large metal door at the end of the hallway. The door has a large transparent window. You see Dr. Robotnik and Gerald standing. Dr. Robotnik is wearing a military uniform, and Gerald is wearing a less decorative version of the armor worn by the soldiers. Hey. Hold on, hold on, my brain's hurting right now. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna read these lines as best large. as I can, but I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. You go got ahead. it, you got go it. Ahead, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> what is it? The door opens, and the camera focuses on Gerald and Dr. Robotnik, who are yes, just different Dad? people now. Like, <laughs> what? Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> what? Keep reading, keep reading, keep reading, keep reading. Keep this reading, is keep reading. some PPG oh, shit. Happening? Keep reading. We slowly zoom in on Dr. Robotnik's face. What is it, D Dad? <laughs> we continue to part ways reading, with reading. Gerald and Dr. Robotnik as the tension builds and the music swells. We see a close-up of Dr. Robotnik's face as he begins to speak. Yes, Dad. <laughs> what happened? What happened? <laughs> what? What? I think, I think... Who's <laughs> Daddy? What? I think Ger I think Gerald's like having a talk with an dead? angel right now or something. <laughs> Is he got mind swapped? What the fuck happened? Is this Freaky I Friday? Think what dying in the hallway. He's just on his hands and he's crawling, seeing his dead father. <laughs> dad, dad. <laughs> You wouldn't know again. Dad is a rank in the military. <laughs> given given this and also like the fucked up fish snake, I think he might just be too old to be invented. <laughs> Gerald, <sighs> I have a special mission for you. What is it, Dad? We see a close up of Dr. Robotnik's face as he begins to speak. Which is the same line I yeah. just fucking read. <laughs> <laughs> he keeps, he keeps <laughs> <laughs> Gerald, the ultimate life form is nearly ready. We part ways with Dr. Robotnik and Gerald as the tension boils. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> what fucking God. What I, I want fucking out of here. I want out of this shit. Cut to city evening. We see the city of Station Square at night. Cut to at interior night. casino evening. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog, with his spikes jailed down and wearing a leather jacket, oh! walks into a casino. Oh. A large yeah. crowd of people can be seen through the entrance. On his heels is Tails, with his two tails curled up in an unsuccessful attempt to make them look like a single tail. He wears a leather jacket as well. Tails stops walking. <laughs> this is an awful plan. The robots will recognize us right away. No, they won't. I fixed their recognition scanners. <laughs> Knuckles walks up to the pair of them, wearing a red leather jacket. <laughs> what are you guys doing here? Weren't you supposed to be in the city with each other? With the others? He's not uh, even in disguise! He's just yeah. wearing a jacket! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. We're just gonna go do that now. Sonic takes off his jacket and hands it to Tails. Here, wear this. <laughs> Two jackets. <laughs> okay. Tails begins okay. putting on the jacket. Hey, guys. The trio turns around to see Rouge the Bat walk towards them. She's wearing a long, sparkly black dress that goes down to her ankles. On her back are a pair of bat-like wings. <laughs> <laughs> this, okay, can I say, this has fucking haunted me for the past week. What do you mean by bat-like? Do you mean they are like bat wings, or do you mean the wings individually are shaped like entire bats? They're bat-like. Well, bat -like. obviously I'm not a bat, so it's the second one. Hey, what are you doing here? I thought you'd be in the city helping the others. <laughs> they don't need my help. Is anyone in the city helping the others? <laughs> Knuckles, relax. They've got it under control. Who's the they? The civilians will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> they they got it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Exterior city, evening. We see Shadow and Silver walking down the street. Shadow wears a red t-shirt with a black jacket over it. On his wrists are a pair of black gauntlets with gold wrist guards. Silver has his hoodie on. <laughs> his, 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 hoodie. his classic it's hoodie. Yo, yeah, Shadow, Shadow walking wait, out wait, there wait, with like out. the coolest Baby. heat and silver dripless. <laughs> this place is a dump. Shut up, it's not that bad. Tell me, when were you planning on telling me that you're moving here? <laughs> I'm not, I just came to visit my friend. Friend? What friend? You, you've never mentioned a friend before. Yeah, well, I made one. Shadow doesn't look amused. I, I, for some reason, I read that like he made one like out of like a homunculus. Keep reading, and maybe. Is it a girl? Silver looks at Shadow with a mix of repulsion and confusion. What? <laughs> 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 Shadow? <laughs> Is he jealous? No, it's a robot. Oh, so you made a friend. You did make a <laughs> friend. <laughs> so you made a friend. A robot. Seriously? I can't imagine being friends with a robot. <laughs> yeah, his name's QB. He's cool. I don't know why you're friends with me. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Suddenly, a black and red hover car appears from around a corner with flashing mm -hmm. blue and red lights on top. Mm -hmm. It stops in front of Shadow and Silver. A voice projects from a speaker on the car. It's Eggman. Shadow, you've committed the most heinous of crimes. You have stolen my doctor's research. Return it and once or face the consequences. Shadow looks at Silver. Did you? Of course he did. The evidence is right there. <laughs> Shadow, is it true? Did you do <laughs> this? <laughs> Where the fuck did why, you come why from? Why is Elise here? Also, have we met? <laughs> Silver turns to look at the speakers below the car. The screen says he did it. Shadow huh? speakers below the car. <laughs> Can't fight with facts on the screen, dude. Shadow? Don't look at me. I've never been here before in my life. <laughs> that doesn't answer the question, Shadow. <laughs> Don't play dumb, Shadow. It's embarrassing. Suddenly, the blue hedgehog puts his arm through the car window and fires a laser from his wrist. Whoa, watch out! Whoa! Oh my god! Holy shit! Whoa! Sonic speeds forward and smashes Shadow and Silver away from the car. As he does this, the doctor fires missiles from the bottom of his car, creating a smoke screen. The car speeds away. Sonic, Shadow, and Silver get up from the ground. Sonic dashes forwards, jumping into the air with a spin attack. As he lands, the car bursts into flames and spins out of control. It crashes into a nearby tree. The three run forward to where the car landed. However, when they get there, it appears empty. Shadow sniffles, but then stops. 
It's pollen season. <laughs> I have allergies. Forgot to take so my Claritin today. <laughs> Sonic looks around. Uh, it's no use. He could be anywhere. It's no it's use. No use. <laughs> it's no use. This will thing. end it. From off screen, a piercing city. Uh, oh, sorry. From off screen, a piercing cry is heard. Sonic and Shadow run to the source of the noise. They see a black hedgehog with green eyes on his hands and knees, sobbing. It's Shadow. <laughs> what? Oh, God! Wait, 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 read the next wait, line, read the next yes, line. Wait, yeah, here wait, comes! Wait. Shadow looks up at Shadow. <laughs> Shadow okay. oh, 2! <laughs> Which one is which? <laughs> okay. I'm sorry, brother. I failed you again. Sonic takes a step back in shock. Shadow looks up at him. I... I failed the whole world. And worst of all, I have failed our promise to her. Sonic sits down next to him. He faces Shadow. Listen, Shadow. It's okay. Shadow punches him in the face. <laughs> no! It's not okay! She's dead because of me! Sonic uses his tail to grab a rock. He throws it into the woods. <laughs> no, I didn't have a tail, I thought he had a second head! He's what? Wait, 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 Sonic's famous tail attack. <laughs> no, 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 he has two heads. So, tail so, time. so, so, things are about to get fucking wild. I just want to say Sh right now, I actually really fucking like where this is going. Yeah, no, <laughs> like it's the direction great. of this. No, just wait. Shadow, listen. What? Let's get back to what's important. What do you mean? Sonic points at Shadow. Sonic points to the woods. <laughs> Sonic points to himself. <laughs> <laughs> From beyond the woods, Amy is heard crying out loud. Oh, Sonic! Please! Sonic runs past Shadow. He looks back at him. Sonic runs into the woods. What? what? Okay. <laughs> okay. Dude, we gotta get back to what's important. <laughs> now back to the woods. Now back to me. Now back to the woods. Oh now back God. to me. Now back. Now back to the woods. No. I think he was. I think it was just saying. I was he saying like, listen, Shadow. There's privacy in the woods <laughs> for you and me. Interior woods, night. Shadow looks at his hands in awe. Shadow looks around, but sees nothing. He instead puts his hands in his pockets and begins walking away. Interior woods, mind. night. Yeah. <laughs> Where's the pockets? Suddenly, a hand grabs Shadow's shoulder. He turns around to see Princess Elise, except it isn't her. Her eyes are red and she looks deranged. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude, what is happening? Do you like it? Oh, Shadow oh, is shocked to do nothing but nod. I, I'm scary, trying. Scary, scary. There, there's a lot of things this could imply. No, it's okay. She's just high. I'm glad nobody else understands my fashion sense. Shadow takes a step back. Except you, Shadow. You understand me. Shadow can't find any words to say. He looks at her with a mix of confusion and intrigue. We're gonna do something amazing together. Just you and me. What is it? You'll see soon. But first, we need to prepare. We've gotta get you a disguise. For a few oh, reasons. A I don't understand, girl. <laughs> Shadow looks at her. Uh, no! We're robbing a bank. <laughs> we have a fucking from <laughs> At least just like, <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna do something. <laughs> <laughs> Sonic runs up to Amy, who is yelling and frantically running around the woods. Where were you? You just left without me! You can't leave me behind like that, Sonic! What are you talking about? I woke up and you were gone! I looked all over the city for you! I've been here the whole time! <laughs> no, you haven't! I would have seen you! You do realize we can run faster than sound, right? Sonic smirks. <laughs> Tails walks up to the two of them. <laughs> Fucking gaslighting <laughs> asshole. <laughs> I, oh, like, I, I, I just love that they, they the entirety of Sonic Adventure one not finding each other. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, I just love how they put like a, like an actual like sitcom laugh break moment there. Like, uh, <laughs> God. what's going on? Facing away from Tails. Sonic's a liar! He says he wasn't gone in the night, but he was! Sonic covers his face in his hands. I can't handle this right now. <laughs> <laughs> Tails pushes Amy. Jesus! <laughs> Stop messing with him! 
<laughs> Let's all sit down and listen to his story. They all sit down on logs <laughs> around a campfire. Sonic sighs and begins telling his story. <sighs> Last night, I saved the city from Dr. Eggman and his minions. I'm gonna guess that's the same doctor that made that fake princess. Where'd you come thing. from? I know. Who are you? I know okay. That. okay. I didn't know that. Where'd you, you know, come from? You know what? Unlike you, Sonic, I have been with Amy all night. <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, that's right. I defeated him with Shadow's help, but in doing so, I caused a lot of collateral damage. So, you saved the city, but you broke it. Pretty much. I came back to the hotel to get some sleep. Next thing I know, Princess Elise is screaming at me for breaking my promise not to leave the hotel room. Wait, she woke you up in the middle of the night to yell at you? Pretty much. She's not a morning person. <laughs> God! <laughs> <Laugh track. laughs> Women, right? <laughs> <laughs> Quick, so, quick question, quick question, Petty. Yeah. I know this is an AI dungeon thing, and I know that sometimes you put in stuff, but did you write that line, or was that AI no, dungeon? No, that was AI dungeon. God bless you, AI dungeon. <laughs> That's... <clears throat> so, so what are you going to do now? Sonic glares at Knuckles. Oh. Knuckles raises his hands in defense. <laughs> I'm going to go back to bed. Yo, yo, Knuckles is like, yo, square up. Yo, <laughs> yo. Tr try some shit. You'll catch these hands. <laughs> Block this overhead. <laughs> Interior hotel. Night. Sonic enters his hotel room and sees Shadow standing in the middle of the room. Oh, hey, Shadow. Didn't expect to see you here. I need to talk to you about something really important. It's about the princess. All right. Well, uh, take a seat. Shadow sits down on the bed. Sonic, why don't you sit over there? Shadow points at the bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking smelly. Shadow, look at me. Tell me what is wrong with this image. <laughs> Sonic walks over to the bathtub and sits down. <laughs> I'm going to tell you something about the princess that you might not know. Okay. She's evil. What? I'm telling you, she's evil. You know how we always talk about things and analyze them to find the truth about them. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> no. What are you even talking about? We dig deeper than what's on the surface. You lost me. I'm, I'm saying the princess is controlling you. She's making you do things against your own will. That's ridiculous. It is? When was the last time you got a haircut? I'm a hedgehog. That's just how we look. Do you have a favorite food? Yes, chili dogs. Have you ever had one? Shadow, get the fuck out of my room. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilarious. That was hilarious. Shadow stands up from the bed and glares at Sonic. Suddenly, a knock is heard on the door. Hello? Is this where the meeting is? It says meeting on the door. Yeah, come in. Okay. Knuckles enters. Shadow turns to face him. Sorry for the mess. Shadow was just leaving. Are Rouge and Silver going to be able to make it? No, they said something came up. Okay, can you give them a call to let them know the meeting time? We got to <laughs> get this taken care of as soon as possible. Oh. Everyone who's here has been briefed on the situation. I love how, like, they're not doing it. They're just like, they keep talking. We gotta do something about this. Fucking <laughs> we <old dude. laughs> yeah. 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 That's like, that's Listen, like, that's a big problem with AI Dungeon. AI Dungeon, like, speaks in so many, like, eventualies. Like, they're very rarely does something mm -hmm. actually happens in my experience. It's okay. Actually, I Actually, I wanted to speak to you about that. Knuckles takes a piece of paper out of his pocket and hands it to Sonic. This is a list of people who can help us. Some of them might be a little unusual, but they all have the skill to help us. Sonic looks at the names on the list. Oh, God. Espio the Chameleon. Big the Cat. Captain William Buccaneer. No, that's a character. That's a character. Dude. Chip. Dude, Chip. 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 Sergeant Chip. O. <laughs> Ivor the Engine. <laughs> That's my OC. <laughs> Professor Uma Mobius Fargod. No, that's Moebius. That's from the comics. Lucas, the flaming centipede. 
<laughs> Espio the Chameleon is a character from the Sonic comics. <laughs> Wait, Big the cat is a character from the Sonic Adventure games. <laughs> <laughs> Sonic folds up the list and stuffs it what? into his leather jacket. Wait, 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 wait. He's been wearing his jacket since the casino. He's been wearing it the whole time. He took it he off. Grows, he grows them. He got a new one. He's in his hotel room. <laughs> he grows them. He's in his hotel room. You, you don't think he has multiple jackets he can pull from? He just fucking got another one. The best part is, is that Knuckles. Wrote all of these down on his <laughs> list, including the words "Espio the Chameleon" is a character from the Sonic comics. He put that in parentheses. That is a character from the Sonic. I, I didn't want you to get lost. Context. I wanted you to make sure. I wanted to make sure you knew who everybody sure. was. Oh my god! Thanks, Nux. Now, what's the situation looking like with the robots outside? Is the city safe? Yeah, the military has everything under control. Okay, uh, let's get going, boys and girls. It's time to save the world. Oh my god. <laughs> Why did you say that? <laughs> no one else is in the room. Knuckles and Shadow. All right, no, kids. Sonic, let... Sonic has Tourette's. That's a tick. <laughs> <laughs> the tick is the whole sentence? Yeah. <laughs> Good. <laughs> let's get going, boys and girls. His Come on, boys and friends. girls. Let's go and save Undertale, <laughs> too. <laughs> Interior, Eggman control room, night. Interior, crocodile, alligator. <laughs> I drive a Chevrolet movie, movie theater. theater. Eggman is sitting in his control room, looking at a screen showing various areas of the city. Robots are various patrolling areas. the streets. <laughs> Queens. Various Robots areas. are patrolling the streets. <laughs> Who's Robot 1? I can that's that's you. you can take that. <laughs> what is our next order, sir? Continue patrolling. How's it going, Eggman? How the fuck did you get in? <laughs> <laughs> Here. Sonic pops in. <laughs> you left the door open. Bugs Bunny sitting on the fucking wall. He does wall the fucking like Minecraft slash TP to Eggman. Can you read the line again, please? How's it going, Eggman? Not great. You made a lot of trouble for me. That's because you're a madman bent on ruling the world. I'm a scientist. A scientist. With a vision. Yeah, you're a madman with a vision. Why are you Not your here, best quip. Sonic? Not your best quip, Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, why? I thought vision belonged to Marvel. <laughs> why are you here, Sonic? Do you intend to stop me from conquering the world? Actually, I came here to stop you from destroying it. That's not- You can conquer it all you like. <laughs> yeah, I don't give a shit. <laughs> Just don't break anything. <laughs> it's too late for that. The planet's life force has already been depleted. It has no chance of recovery. I have the planet's survival in my hands. It's gone. <laughs> maybe, maybe I should destroy it. <laughs> oh? so, what is happening? So, 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 so you're here to stop me from taking over the world. And you're threatening to destroy the planet. You see how unreasonable you're being? <laughs> <laughs> oh I, love how, I love how Sonic's number one rhetorical strategy is to not understand what the fuck is going on no, and excuse the other person. Of gaslight not everyone. Yelling everyone. <laughs> yeah. you, see, you see how unreasonable you're being? God. I see someone who's lost his way. Look at you. You got me in your clutches, but you're not going to finish me off. You're not going to take over the world. Why? Because I've lost. That's why. No, you haven't. You just don't realize it yet. What the fuck is what happening? What is going on? The heel turn. Oh, but I have. You see, you've won your little battle, whatever. But you've stopped my plans of war domination. True. That's not why I'm here. I came to offer you a chance at real victory. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. Holy fuck! <laughs> this is this, this, the the back the backhandedness. <laughs> this was the plan all along from the beginning. R really? It seems to me that you're the one who's lost. You've lost your way, Sonic. I'm here, aren't I? I'm trying to help you. Help me. <laughs> That's a good one. But you're right. Maybe I'm not here to help you. Maybe I'm here to help the humans. Or even the planet itself. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to let everyone go. 
Oh yeah? And what are you gonna do about it? I challenge you. A race. If I win, you have to promise to never bother these people again. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I've been planning this for years. <laughs> Eggman presses a button on his control panel, opening a large metal door to the right. Mm. Beyond the door stands Gerald and the ultimate life form from the gunhold. So, you're entering your super weapon in this race? I'm not entering anything. The ultimate life form is autonomous. Its own being. It's the first of its kind. What, you're just letting it loose? Aren't you worried it'll kill everyone? It can do whatever it wants. <laughs> God, what are you doing? <laughs> Uh, ignores Gerald, addresses everyone else, uh, whoever that was. I don't expect you'll be able to beat him. He's the future. Roars. <laughs> right. Ignores the ultimate life form, addresses him. Will he redo that? Just... Um, anyway, uh, <laughs> <laughs> to his former glory. A new era, a new beginning. But a race first, yeah? One last race. Me and the ultimate life form. If I win, you agree to never bother these people again. If the ultimate life form wins, well, I guess you can do whatever you want. <laughs> Sonic turns from the screen and looks at the ultimate life form. You ready? The ultimate life form lets out a loud guttural roar, turning to the exit. <laughs> Yo, everyone, remember, we're doing this so you don't have to put up with this madman anymore. Uh Silently, am the ultimate I'm... life form marches forward towards the door. Am I still the madman in the situation? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, no, honestly, like... like madman is just a separate character. <laughs> honestly, like... Yeah. Son Sonic at this point is, like, putting out massive fucking Nagi toe yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> What are you doing? You scared? The ultimate life form turns to Sonic. Roar. Roar. It seems angry. Roar. Very angry. <laughs> That's it. Come get me, you stupid hunk of junk. The ultimate robot. life form advances towards Sonic. It's not very fast, but its angry presence is certainly commanding. <laughs> Sonic speeds off to I'll the left. I'll give it that. <laughs> <laughs> and bye. <laughs> Race begins, I guess. Yeah. Exterior, city, night. The entire city is in flames. Oh no. Buildings are crumbling, fires are burning, and the streets are littered with bodies. Oh my Why? god. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> well, we're about to we find did out. it, Sonic. We saved the city. <laughs> the city's people try to escape, but there's nowhere to run. Shadow, Silver, Rogue, Rogue and Amy are standing looking at the Do chaos. Something. <laughs> the streets are filled with escapees running from the carnage. Why is this happening? It's the end. The world's gonna end. We need to get off the planet. What are you talking about? We need to find out what's happening. <laughs> Ignores Silver and Rouge turns to Knuckles. <laughs> we need to find the other. Knuckles is around. Omnipresent. <laughs> I've always been here. <laughs> <laughs> also, Amy's just Amy's just here and is just being like yeah. double ignored. I guess. <laughs> Doesn't, doesn't Knuckles just pop up out of nowhere, like, in the series, like, in canon? Like, pops out of a yeah. manhole, Sometimes yeah. Sometimes it, like, comes out Knuckles of manholes everywhere here. system. Yeah. Mm -hmm. they're, 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 like, at the top of a building, and Knuckles just burrows out from the top. <laughs> comes out of a trash can. They're dead. You didn't see what I what? saw. Everyone's dead. All of them. What the <laughs> fuck? Okay. <laughs> the screen goes black. This is how it always happens. Why does everyone give up so easily? We're never going to survive if we just accept death. <laughs> the screen fades back into the city streets. Shadows run across the street. Shadows <laughs> run across the street. Screams and roars fill the air. A rotten fish-like smell wafts through the air. Oh, holy shit. It's no use. There it yeah. is. Yeah. 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 We got a voiceover. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, tell me. Was that, was that one AI dungeon? That was AI dungeon. Yeah. I, literally, yeah. Yeah. I literally, when when I saw it generate that, I like actually screamed <laughs> in real life. I was like, <laughs> a large beast is in the center of the city. It looks like something straight out of hell. The beast is covered in burnt orange scales. On its shoulders stand Princess Elise. She raises her hand, and the beast lets out a mighty roar. She is evil! Wait, wait, is this Revelation? 
No, this is Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, Sonic Destruction. This is episode Everybody one. Knows that Sonic the Hedgehog yeah. in the Bible. This is the episode same. one. <laughs> I think this is literally Revelation. Why are you putting us through this? Kill him! Kill them all! <laughs> Damn, the first intent at murder and now misgendering Rouge. Rude as fuck. <laughs> the dragon lets out a roar, roar and advances towards the helpless citizens. Uh, to Silver and Rouge. Go! Find something to help us fight this monster! Rouge yeah, nods okay. and sprints off into one of the charred streets of the city. Silver hesitates, looking back at the monstrosity. He closes his eyes and takes a deep breath. <gasps> <laughs> hey, a new record! <laughs> <laughs> I'm staying with you guys. If we're all going to die, I'm gonna die fighting by your side. I've turned into Morty. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Silver stands next to Shadow. Stay close then. That was a lot. Okay. Steroids, steroids, <laughs> toast <laughs> <to> every <laughs> smile. <laughs> what? It's I love, cool. I love what? it. This is no I love it. <laughs> she is, she truly is deranged. Yeah. She's this deranged. is the madman. This is we more, found him. This is, this is, this is going from deranged to unhinged. Yeah. <laughs> fucking, fucking, fucking Elise. Fucking is Elise. The madman help us save us. <laughs> Elise post bong rip. What if Spider Man was steroids? <laughs> <laughs> Spider Man would just really gas up. Turns out she jacked up the ohms way too high. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'll, it'll, you'll be fine. Like, come on. God. Elise makes a fist, and then the dragon bursts forward. It flies straight into Shadow, sending him to the ground. Ugh. Gets up, spits out blood. Damn it. <laughs> he said it. It's payback time for what you did to me, Shadow. The dragon flies towards Shadow for a second attack. Shadow dodges out of the way. What are you talking about, Elise? I would never hurt you. Liar! I saw what you did! You burned my city to the ground! No, your mind is it's just playing tricks on you. I've, I've never been even been to- You invaded <laughs> my city and slaughtered my people! Oh my god, she's so high. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I've never even been to she Uvu Javar. Cut to interior city hall. The mayor of the city, Jason King, a balding fat man in a cheap suit, man, sits come in on. his chair. In front of him are five masked figures. <gasps> Two of them are knuckles and tails. <laughs> One is uh, one is a man who is obviously Eggman, <laughs> and the other two. Well, no. that's for you to, to that's for me to know and you to find out. He's just wearing like like fucking Groucho Marx glasses. I like how if you say one is one man is obviously Eggman. Like you just didn't identify one is Knuckles. I I identified two <laughs> animals. Yeah. yeah. I I don't understand. How'd you guys do it? That's not important, Mayor King. What is important is that we did it. We saved. Oh, can I read it again? Read it yeah, again? yeah. The city is Totally, totally not saved, yeah. yeah. We did it. We saved the, the city. There's bodies on the street. They just put up a poster over his window to make it look fun. Let me try again. The I'm greatest so tragedy that, that fucking Station Square has ever seen. An active battle going on outside. <laughs> we Save did it. it. I think this is just an allegory for how Texas is about COVID. God. <laughs> God. Let me try to get it. Let me try to get it. Get him. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's not Fuck important, Mayor King. What is important is that we did it. We saved our city. Uh, I, I don't understand. We had a problem. A big problem. A demon from another dimension was going to destroy this city. But we what found was? a way to stop it. So why is there still a large dragon outside terrorizing everyone? <laughs> and who's that princess <laughs> next to it? There goes my fucking can I, theory. Can I can I admit something? I wrote that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I figured. Thank you. I, I figured that that seemed like a very uh, you lying. Steps forward, because someone pulled at the wrong thread and unraveled our timeline. 
There was once a oh. hero who saved the city, but now he's gone. <laughs> Furious. You made a mess of things, little one. <laughs> <laughs> Sarcastic. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Dude, it's Sergeant O! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh, nice. yeah. Dude, it's Sergeant O! He was, one of, he was here this whole time! That's My so God. cool! Ignores Tails to Eggman. This is all your fault! You were supposed to save the city, not destroy it! Don't you think I know that? You fuck! <laughs> please tell me that's AI! Please tell me that's AI! Please Please tell me that's AI. Not destroy it. Was that the AI? Was that the AI? Listen, I'm almost certain that was a, that Benny wrote that one. No, like, that was God. the AI. Yes! <laughs> Holy shit! That's awesome! That definitely feels like an AI dungeon sentence. The mayor's eyes dart from me, each of the masked figures to the next. He looks confused. Confused. What, what the hell's going on? Who are all you people? <laughs> oh the ghost is as he just left his body. And scene. He just realized what the hell's going on. This town is doomed. Goodbye. Everybody here is so zonked out. The Sonic, the Sonic <laughs> heroes, their whole prerogative is just to convince everybody that they already did everything. Like, it, yeah. that is done. <laughs> We did it. We saved the city. <laughs> they're, they're, they're all, they are, that they already did everything, and anyone who protests is fucking crazy for thinking otherwise. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh my god! They're the gaslight gatekeep girl bosses. Oh my yes! god! Oh my god. Wow. We got it, everybody. Wait, wait, we hear the whole time. Who are the other two masked figures? Oh, you know, <laughs> Sar Sergeant O and SB SBO the chameleon is a character from the Sonic the Hedgehog comics. True. <laughs> Interior. Eggman control room, night. Sonic and the ultimate life form are locked in an incredible battle. They fly in quick circles around each other, trading blows with their claws. The ultimate life form lands a heavy punch to the side of the hedgehog's head. The hedgehog, however, quickly recovers and elbows the monster in the face. The monster stumbles backwards, but then leaps forward with a heavy punch of his own. The hedgehog rolls out of the way and onto his feet as the monster falls forward. The hedgehog quickly leaps up to meet him, bringing both sets of claws down onto the monster's head. You ready to give up yet? I have to save the world, you know. Can't be wasting time with you. The monster doesn't respond. Instead, he whips Sonic off of his body and onto the floor. The hedgehog quickly skids along the floor, but is quick to leap back up. The monster slowly approaches him, and Sonic backs away slowly. Come on, you fucker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually I'm invested. The monster lashes out at the hedgehog, striking him in the chest. Sonic is sent hurtling through the air and slams into a computer screen. The monster walks slowly towards him. Sonic gets up slowly with a hand pressed against his chest. Uh, no, no. He looks up at his opponent. The monster lets out a terrible growl and speeds towards the hedgehog. Sonic doesn't have enough time to dodge. The monster slams into him, the weight of his body crushing the life out of him. Oh, it wasn't oh. fast enough. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog reaches a hand out to the control console above him as he lets out his final breath. What? Desperately oh pushing God? the big red button that says, release lock. The button clicks and a loud screeching sound is heard as the wall stood behind the monstrosity for so long falls to the ground. The ultimate life form is flung from the ship, crashing down to the city below. Sonic's body lies there on the floor. The ship, Holy shit. without a pilot, is quickly taken over by computerized controls. What? It turns and flies away from Earth. Sonic? So, so, this really is like Ultron. Listen, I was, I was concerned that like, ah shit, Sonic's fucking dead. Then I remembered, wait, Elise! <laughs> yeah. oh, oh, no. No. Oh, no. <laughs> so I mean, you know, you that's that's one idea. Exterior, uh, city, night. The city continues to burn as Shadow Elise and the Dragon are locked in battle. Elise looks up as the flying fortress soars overhead. The dragon lets out a mighty roar, roar. as he realizes what's happened. Shadow turns to see the ship flying off into the distance. Shit! <laughs> shit! <laughs> Sonic's line! Shit, shit, Sonic's line says shit. Fuck! <laughs> ah, the dragon chases after the ship, 
as the heroes from below watch it fly away for over the trees. <laughs> Suddenly, the dragon is intercepted by the ultimate life form's body crashing into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Holy hell. <laughs> the fucking precision. The, the dragon has been completely smashed in the head. <laughs> the fucking precision! Just, wait, keep going, means, wait, 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 keep going, keep going, keep going. That just means he's high. <laughs> Shadow runs over to it and puts two bullets straight through its head. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't already oh dead. Let's fucking go! <laughs> <laughs> the building rubbles slightly. Shadow turns to Elise, who lays on the ground in shock at what has happened to her beloved dragon. Shadow runs over to her and gently picks her head up off the ground. <laughs> Come on. Let's get out of here. He's gone, Shadow. I know he's gone. I'm not an idiot. <laughs> the fight's not over. <laughs> we need to get out of here. There's no way of knowing how much damage that ship did as it was flying overhead. This city could be leveled by an explosion any moment. Shadow, I don't want to run anymore. <gasps> well, that fucking sucks. We're in Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> don't say that. We have to keep going. No. It's done for me, Shadow. I want you to take me home. But... This city... was our home. No. It was never my home. And I don't think it was ever yours, either. It was a place we passed the time. But the Earth is our home. What? It's what? where we belong. <laughs> <laughs> it's where we should be laid to rest when we die. What? Have they okay. been on another planet the whole time? <laughs> where, where are we? Where, <laughs> I thought, okay. The plot twist of the fucking century. We're on the faraway planet known as Station Square. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, wait. We We're on, on Mobius. On the planet Like, where are we at? <laughs> We're on Mobius, guys. <laughs> Look, it's the Sonic 2 Worlds thing. <laughs> I do. Oh, do you really believe that? I do. Please, take me home. Take me home to Earth. <laughs> what? Sh Shadow nods. He picks her up, cradling her in his arms. <sighs> Let's go home. Where are we? <laughs> he walks. I am all I am. What the fuck <laughs> is happening? <laughs> Go ahead and try to see through me. Do it if you can. Interior, city hall, night. We're back here, dude. <laughs> Jason witnesses the aftermath of the city's destruction on his computer screens. He turns back to the guy with the guy with multiple monitors. I'm looking on my multiple screens. <laughs> he turns back to the masked figures in front of him. And size. Uh, as much as it would be in the government's best interest to keep this organization alive, I'm sorry. We can't afford to keep supporting this group when so much is at stake. You can't be serious. Is he talking about Sonic and his team? <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid I am. We tried to save it, we failed. And now we gotta clean up this mess. This is <laughs> Calm down, little creature. Calm down, you little freak. Calm down, you little freak. This organization will cause more harm to this world than any other thing in existence. You can't seriously believe that. I absolutely do, and I'm going to prove it. The group begins to un <laughs> the group begins to argue among themselves as they try to come to grips with their situation. Silence! I know this comes as a shock, but it's for the greater good of the world. Suddenly, Amy and Rouge enter the room. It's about time you got here. We've been waiting forever. <laughs> what? You? You are here in my house under my permission, and you can't me wait. Huh? Amy learned how to gaslight. <laughs> <laughs> and it's trying it on hard mode. <laughs> oh my god. The group turns towards the newcomers, all of them sharing confused glances. Alright, what's going on? 
You tell us. You sent us a message saying we were all needed here. I most certainly did not send any such message. Well, someone did. This is ridiculous. If no one sent a message, how did all of us end up here? <laughs> all of a sudden, in, in walks Samuel L. Jackson as Nick Fury. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm as confused by all this as you are. The character Where becomes self-aware. <laughs> Holy shit. Wait, 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 wait. We're in grave danger. No, no. Say the line. 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 Red. Say the line. Red. Did you write this funny line? Everybody, shut up. Red, you have to sell this. Oh my God, there's so much pressure. You got this. You got it. Fucking hell. You got it. I believe in you, Red. We're in grave danger. The killer is among us. <laughs> That's among us. Why would any of us kill the group? We're all rich and famous because of it. <laughs> yeah, what? this is some sort of sick joke. I think we all should leave if this is going to turn into a massacre. I agree. Let's all just leave now. <laughs> a voice cries out from off screen. It's the voice of Gerald Robotnik. He's just as confused as the others are. <laughs> Wait, stop. What's going on? <laughs> the group turns to look at him. The city is destroyed because of your insolence. Why would I destroy the city? I live here! <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what? You raised some good points oh there, buddy. <laughs> oh, wait. That was, that was so good. Wait. Oh, man. Wait, this next line's loaded. This next line's loaded. <laughs> That's not the only thing. This book, this so-called book of prophecy from 7,000 years ago, <laughs> says that the world will soon hearts. come to an end, and you're the one who will bring about its destruction. What? I am? <laughs> wait, was, was that no wait, 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 wait. We have, oh wait, we have to, I'm so fucking excited. Yeah, we almost finished. There goes done. my good day. <laughs> yes, the government has known about you for quite some time now. We've been trying to stop you for years. Well, I have some bad news for you. Your plan has failed. Sonic the Hedgehog is dead. <laughs> the group once again begins arguing with one another. Sonic Jason tells everyone dead. to shut up. Shut up! I don't think that's entirely true. I'm fairly certain that hedgehog over there is him. Everyone looks at the mysterious figure standing in the corner. <laughs> Sonic? <gasps> is that you? The figure doesn't answer. Instead, he slowly and silently steps from the shadows. This mysterious man is revealed to be none other than Sonic. No longer a hedgehog, but a human being. Huh? <laughs> wait, wait, we need to finish. We need to finish. <coughs> oh my Everyone god. Everyone is shocked. That's him. It's him. The prophecy has been fulfilled. Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> 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 Oh, oh my god. God damn. What? what? So that's what a yes. fucking roller coaster. So that's Sonic Destruction wow. Episode 1. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh, yeah.